So uh, I got a few things to read to you before I go from our good folks at the week. Still continue to look for a sponsorship from them, but they're not paying attention. (laughs) First, from the world of AI, Microsoft Travel published an AI written article listing the Ottawa Food Bank, which provides free meals to the needy as an attraction hungry visitors shouldn't miss. And is that ever artificial intelligence at work? Our kids are going to be really relying on, uh, relied on uh, their parents, uh, relied on the adults in the community for quite some time who are idiots. We are idiots. We are idiots. Collectively, we are fucking idiots. Uh, If you think that your side should be moving further ahead, uh, we've not been able to figure out how either side has been able to move further ahead because we can't agree on reality. So it's difficult, and the kids are seeing that. And so now they're going to be relying on this artificial intelligence, which seems to be, in many turns, dumber than a post, an attraction, the Ottawa Food Bank, an attraction for the for hungry people, for the needy. Whew. Attraction that hungry visitors shouldn't miss. So, uh, folks, when you're in Ottawa, remember, head on over to the Ottawa Food Bank and say, hey, Artificial intelligence sent me. What what do you got to uh, what do you got that'll uh, kind of uh, you know calm my peckishness? There's a word for you. I love saying peckish. It's it's a, it's a nice word to describe uh, hunger. I think not hunger hunger, but just a little. Mm, I could use a snack. I don't mean to make fun. I, I hope you. But this is when you get crazy because your brain with with what's happening. I, if, if you thought that this is making fun. I'm making fun of artificial intelligence. Jesus. And the fact I have a pension for the word peckish. Also, Woodland, North Carolina, and this is stunning, having gone to the University of North Carolina, and there were some moments there that I thought about some of the folks in this state, uh, and that was way back when, but they continue to just be stunning on many levels. They've rejected a proposed solar farm after residents expressed fears that it would consume too much sunlight. This is the kind of stuff I've got to explain uh, over in um, over in Ireland or anywhere that I travel outside of the United States. Uh, if they see something like this, the people um, they think that a solar farm is going to consume too much sunlight. Resident Jane Mann told the town council that the farm would steal sunlight that plants need. Well, I mean. You live in a rural area, I believe. You're living in farmland and you have no idea how the sun works. That uh, you think that actually the sun can be diverted from into the solar farm. And another resident warned that it might suck up all the energy from the sun. You look, listen to that. Okay. Would suck up all the energy from the sun. All right. It is why we need to teach science, basic science. This person lives in farmland and believes that the energy from the sun can be sucked up. It could be sucked up by one fucking plant then, all right? One hungry plant, just desperate to, get, to have its photosynthesis kick in on a level you can't imagine, all right? Wow. And if you believe that, then I guess you think that it, you must be growing one of those, the, the, you know, like a man-eating plant, like in... Um, as we saw in Little Shop of Horrors, somebody's got to be kidding me. Somebody has to be kidding me. And I think the camera just futzed a little and I apologize, but I, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if my head gets smaller or bigger. It's because this is, it, it just reflects in part physically what's happening to me mentally when I read that. Okay? Suck up all the energy from the sun. The council, this is the, the city, the, the uh, town council, uh, rejected the proposal, despite assurances that solar panels do not draw uh, additional sunlight. They were assured, and they voted against the solar farm. They voted against the possibility of getting some, really what would be, uh, after a while, if you pay for the solar panels, free energy, because uh, uh, they don't suck up all the energy of the sun. And that I leave you with. There will be more to follow, and that I am sure, uh, because... We continue to really in the, it, we, if there was an Olympics of stupidity, I just think we would win, especially if we think that the, the sun, uh, that the sun could have all of its energy sucked up by solar panels or sucked up by anything. 
The Mind Reels.